Yo, 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 what's up, y'all? My name is Red Nail Roy. Welcome back to my channel, Fish and Trips. And we back for another vlog, y'all. And back for another episode of Freshwater Tuesdays. Once again, Freshwater Tuesday is I go around Houston in the surrounding area. I fish freshwater spots to check out and vlog about it. Simple enough, simple concept. So today I am at Deputy Darren Go Forest Park out here in Northwest Houston is to check out this lake. They have like an eight lake or lake or something like that. Then they got catfish or some bass. I'm not sure. This is my first time. This is Robert told me to come check it out. So I'm going to come check it out, okay? You never know if people are nice or mean. I don't really care. You're gonna talk to me regardless. How you doing, sir? Any luck? Okay, that's a nice one right there. Enjoy the vlog. Let go! All right, y'all, so this is my first look at Go Fork Park. Um, the lake kind of extends out from here all the way across and goes way over there. So it is a like it's pretty pretty large. Got an old man over there fishing. Here's a pro tip. If you see an old guy fishing, he knows what the hell he's doing. Let's see if we can get some knowledge. Let's see how much. Just gotta sneak up behind him a little bit. Remember my technique. If, if he's catching, go stand right by him and fish right next to him. Good morning, sir. How you doing? Good. Any luck yet? No? Bluegill? Yeah, this is my first time here. Is it like bluegill, catfish? Yeah? Yes. Oh, big carp? Really? Yes. I might have to get my net. Yeah? So bluegill, carp, any bass? Bass. Bass? Yeah. Hmm, okay. About the seven pound, eight pound bass. Oh wow. So big fish, huh? Yes, yes. Okay, no problem. What kind of bait you're using? What? What kind of ah, bait? This is bait. This is uh, mm -hmm. oh, okay. Corn. Oh, corn. Uh, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay, cool. All right, well, thanks for the tips. Good luck to you, okay? Nice to meet you. Bye. Bye. Hmm. Interesting. So he did say that there were um, some big carp in here. Now I didn't bring my net because I'm like, there's nothing in here that big. I got my fish grips. Should I go back and get my net? Nah, nah. Remember this in the vlog, y'all. Remember I said, should I go back and get my net? So if something happens, you can say I told you so. And I'm going to regret this. So what he said that um, apparently there is carp, bluegill, bass, and catfish. I never caught a carp before, and etc. So we'll see what we can do, and um, get the day started. All right, come well, on, let's go. Like I said, so to start, let's catch a bird. Those look great, man. Those are like perfect Cornish hen size rotisserie birds right there. Can anybody tell me what kind of birds those are? Now y'all know me. You always gotta have a backup plan. If you don't catch a fish, see what other wildlife is around you and eat it. Including fish, turtles, squirrels, and as a last resort, humans. Now, preferably kids, because you know, the meat is still tender. All right, so this guy told me the spot I need to come to is over here. So let's go try this other spot. We'll see. Okay, so you say the good spot is over here? Right there on the corner? Yes. Okay, cool. Thank you. Oh, man. Do you fish here a lot? Do you fish here a lot? Yes, but this is time. This is better on the spring time. Spring? In October. Ah, October? Yes, mm -hmm. this is spring. This is April. Ah, okay. It's not bad. Uh, need to kill the time. <laughs> yeah, something to do, right? Good way to kill the time. Yeah. 
Oh, you retired? Okay, I want to be like you when I grow up. <laughs> Thank you. All right. <laughs> Thank you. So he says that basically um, he's retired and it's just the way to kill a time. See, that's what I want to do. I just want to be old, not working no more, just fish until I die. Living a dream. He's living a dream. Like I said, I do have a dog park here. Nothing that I'm interested in going to. Because as you can see, the dogs here are racist. The dogs here in Northwest Gore Fort Park are racist. Now, if I was to jump over there and use his ass to cut bait, people think I'm wrong. How funny is that? Anyway, y'all, let's head to this new spot and see what we can do. Looks beautiful, though. Let's go. All right, so here's the other side. I'm just left of the racist dog park over here. It's definitely less current than the other side, so I see why people might prefer this side to the other one. How you doing? We'll see. Nice area over here. I'm gonna go past this pole. Okay, so the water over here doesn't seem to be moving as fast. So we'll try it out. I mean the best thing you can do is just try. It never hurts to try. Unless you fail. If you fail, then it hurts to try. Let's see here. Where's this dog going? Oh man, I swear to God, if this dog comes over here, y'all. There we go. The dog is it's really interested in jumping in the water for some reason. I'm not sure what that's about. All right, y'all, so let's get settled. Let's see what's happening over here. Let's see what's going down. But we'll find out. Hmm, no fish? No? So what's over here like? Catfish? Catfish? Yeah? Carp? Any carp? No? <laughs> you know what It's funny. Alright, great. So he hasn't been having any luck. Which is not a good sign. Okay, so, good news and bad news. Bad news is, been out here three hours, no bites. The good news is, everybody else out here fishing, no bites. So it's not just me, okay? We can say today that it's not just me. So what I'm gonna do is go ahead and probably spend the last hour going back to artificial, see if I can get a link up on a bass or something because clearly they haven't stocked this fish, they haven't stocked this fish, they haven't stocked this lake with any fish in a long time. Okay, because nobody's catching. Because here you have eight acres of lake, beautiful land, and I'm literally the only person out here fishing. Fourth largest city in the US, and there's nobody out here. 
clear sign that there's no fish out here. So we're gonna try one more hour with artificial to see can we save the skunk. Let go. y'all so here is the other side got a gentleman over here fishing we'll see up to got three rods oh, he got something on this leader let's we'll see you never know if people are nice or mean i don't really care you're gonna talk to me regardless how you doing sir any luck Okay, that's a nice one right there. I like your setup. Oh, yeah. I had a couple of bites, but ain't nothing to get hit now. Yeah, I've been talking to a lot of people, and you're the first person I've seen in like three hours who actually has something. Yeah, I caught it. I got it here. I got it here kind of early. Yeah? I left and I came back. Hit. I come out here and I come out here in the morning. I catch about two or three catfish when I got here early. Oh, really? Like what's on like five or six or? I got out of here about 6.30. 6.30? Yeah, then I had to leave to go take my son to the bus and I came back. So I've been out here about 30, about an hour now. Yeah. That's good, man. You just fishing bottom, huh? Yeah. It was some big bitches. It was some big fish jumping up right over here. Oh, for real? Yeah, it's my first time out here, so I'm not sure what spots are, you know. Well, a lot of people I see over there at that little spillway down there, but. Mm hmm. Right there? Yeah. Mm -hmm. now, now where the birds are a little bit further down. Yeah, yeah, in the corner. Yeah. Oh, yeah, some people go right, right across. Mm-hmm. But see that guy standing over there? Yeah, that's where I started at this morning. Yeah, he, I, seen a, I seen a couple people call him catch a bunch of tilapia out there, too. Yeah, it looked like he was catching, like, um, some bluegill or something like that. Yeah, good cut, babe. That's true. Depends on how big enough. they bigger than your hand, I'm, I'm eating them. <laughs> right. <laughs> that's a nice one right there. You know, I was coming back to the truck feeling defeated. Um, this is going to just explain how I got skunked again today um, at Deputy Darren Go Force Park. Beautiful park, etc. Um, just no fish for me. I did see that one guy catch that one nice catfish. The other guy was catching some bluegills. Um, so yeah, that's just not happening. But that little bit of generosity that little girl um, showed me by saying hello made me feel better. So I don't feel as bad now. Yeah. So I hope y'all enjoyed the vlog. I know nothing happened, but it is what it is. It's what you signed up for and when you subscribe, tell you, you know, it's my channel. You know, this is what we do. I show you the places. I don't really catch no fish, but I show you where you can come fish to catch a fish if you want to catch a fish. Just comment below where I should go next for Freshwater Tuesday. If you want me to continue Freshwater Tuesdays, I'm gonna need 100 likes. I don't care if I'm gonna catch a fish, 100 likes, okay? If you're not subscribed, don't judge me for this vlog. Go watch some more vlogs. I swear the other ones are better than this one. Then if you like those, subscribe. See y'all. See y'all on Friday. Peace.